one. Greetings, beautiful people. My name's Anti Social Worker, um, aka Paul Wellings. I was called um, in the music press a militant music legend. I'm not sure if I can live up to that. But I was one of the original rebel pioneers of underground black music on the iconic LWR pirate radio station. I toured with reggae icons like Peter Tosh, Bob Marley's partner, and Eka Mouse. And I performed uh, with the likes of Billy Bragg, Linton Quasi Johnson, John Cooper Clark, and Benjamin Zephaniah, to name but a few. I recorded uh, my first album with the UK's leading uh, dub producer, the Mad Professor of Massive Attack fame. Um, this is the uh, Japanese import. You can probably see some of the Japanese writing on it. Uh, did very well in Japan. Um, and I was championed by Radio 1 DJ John Peel back in the day. I've written for the seminal NME music paper and I DJed as Mad Hatter Paul uh, Pasha in Ibiza and Ministry of Sounds in London. Now I've returned with a new art form and a new album and uh, it, the new art form is called Grime Poetry um, and it's an album that savages the government. So it's by Anti-Social Worker, it's called Militant Business and Grime Poetry. Um, I'll show you the back if you want to see that. I can show you the inside, it's, it's a lovely piece of work if you want to see that. Okay. Um, so born, I was born and raised in the London New Towns and the East End. Um, I was described as a PR's wet dream because I was a bit of a hustler, a writer, an MC, a DJ, a musician, an author and a freedom fighter. And I described the new album as Johnny Rotten meets Gets. I moved to the East Coast during the pandemic and it gave me peace of mind to create another album after a long absence. I teamed up with West London's finest rapper, Le Magnifique, on his Top black indie label m1music.com, which is where you can buy the album on. It's only nine pounds. Um, and the rest is history. I make righteous anger uh, music that comes from a good heart in trying to bring unity, equality, justice, and peace. <clears throat> I'm a street poet and a multicultural white Londoner. I was partly raised in the East End's Tower Hamlets Borough, the most, I think I was there for about 30 years, the most multicultural place on the planet. I know the benefits of embracing other cultures and fighting all the bigotry, and my music reflects that with influences from reggae, hip-hop, trap and grime. Unlike the white gatekeepers of some black music scenes who want to se separate the music from the culture that created it at the festivals they run, I'll never forget the foundations of underground black music that I helped pioneer on the iconic LWR pirate radio station. And above all, I'll never forget the house parties we had to hold because racist club door policies in the 80s and 90s wouldn't allow a largely black audience in. We had to be militant and fight back in those days. We played mainly message music, not the commercial lovey-dovey stuff that the gatekeepers played. We created our own spin groove scene. The lyrics on this album are my whole life story about fighting against injustice, but I'm a lovable rude boy, not a bad boy. So the album by Anti-Social Worker is called Militant Business and Grime Poetry. It's available exclusively on CD format from leading indie black music label m1music.com. Peace out.